Good evening, star pupils. I'm your host, friend, and life coach, Mrs. Divine Awakening, and I bridge the gap between intuition and intelligence. Today, I'm here with my son, and I had a really proud mother parenting moment when he told me something yesterday. So I've been on this quest for a divine speech. That's something I've been working on. I've said that plenty of times in my videos. And there's always something to learn and discover about the words that we use every day. And my son has been obviously paying attention to this journey and the, the knowledge that's been being taught when we are uncovering the truths of these words. So do you mind telling them, son, what it is that you told me um, she, you discovered? She, I discovered that the word late you can't use because you or, it's use. not divine to use because... There's more than one definition of late. What? So why can't we use late? You can't use late because that can be like on a show. They might say, oh, this is my late goldfish. Mm, that means it. not around anymore. Yes. Yeah, so when I asked him how, what do you mean? What about the word late? Um, he said, just think about it. How many ways is that word used? And that to me was the mind-blowing moment is that my son understands that it's about when you get it when it makes sense to you when it starts to resonate at where you're at so he's aware of the fact that he can lead you to the water but he can't make you drink it so he can tell you what it means but it's not going to make the same impact as if you sat and thought about it yourself or you came to the conclusion yourself so that's a very proud parenting moment for me to see that my child is also being aware of his words and um uh, expanding his consciousness. And how did you discover this word had multiple meetings? What were you doing? I watched TV shows. What TV show were you watching? Naruto. Yeah, so he was watching some anime. He's like, <laughs> from anime, mom. So <laughs> thank you, universe, for anime, because, you know, literally there are so many things that can get through to our people um, on a spiritual level that... Um, other avenues wouldn't be able to get through to them in. So uh, because he made me so proud, we're going to go ahead and go on a quest and do a Roblox journey. It's going to be my first day playing Roblox with my child. And he's so excited. He's so excited. So um, look for my gamer tag. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's called Mommy Gamer 07. <laughs> Thank you. Anything else you want to say? I just want to say, remember to use divine words and don't just say one word. And if you look it up, look up the words you say and if it look it up, then look at the etymology. Because sometimes like the word nice, you might when you look it up, it might say that nice means like you did something kind. But the etymology of it is foolish. So somebody might say that was a nice that was a nice thing you just did back in the days, and then that would mean that was a foolish thing you just did. Yeah, so you want to be really clear on the words that you are manifesting and what you are saying. Thank you, Star Peoples. Have a wonderful day.